Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It's yours truly, Eight Thoughts, the cock of gold, the balls of and the anus of awesomeness. Thank you for hanging out. Thanks for joining me here. Hope you're all doing fantastic. There's a little something serious that I'd uh, actually like to talk to you uh, folks out there in the good land of YouTube today. Now, Ali A, don't ask how I know this, okay? Just don't ask. It's embarrassing. But well, nonetheless, I'd have to admit, basically, I do watch Ali A videos. But Ali A did a video, essentially, that was a Navy recruiting. Navy recruiting. Why do I talk like if I'm some Asian just got off the boat straight from fucking Hong Kong? Hi, everybody. My name is Wayne. I'm very happy to be here. I'm I'm a FUD. Anyways. Ali A did a recruiting video. Um, oh, yeah, hey, you know what? Battlefield 4, best first-person shooter in the fucking world right now in the background. On the PC, the best fucking gaming console in the world. Get revived. I'm laying motherfuckers down here, busting caps and bitches' asses, taking names as if I was goddamn Muhammad Ali, mixed in with Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, a little bit of Clint Eastwood back in the day, escaping from Alcatraz with the 357 fucking Magnum, busting cap and niggas' asses. Do you feel lucky, punk? Do you feel lucky? Okay, now that the insanity's out of the way, let's get real serious here. So, Ali A did a video which was essentially, not essentially, it was 100% a Navy recruiting video on his channel. Now, I personally think that's a super fucking scumbag move. I got nothing with people who support the Army or what your, basically your stance is on, you know, armed conflicts or the Navy or the fucking Marines or whatever it may be or the SS or whatever the fuck it happens to be. Any kind of, um, I guess, armed conflict is the best way to put it. That's not the point here. The point is, though, is this is a gaming channel. It, it relies on making call... Not even a gaming, it's a Call of Duty channel. And on top of that, let's just jump on the point that he's obviously paid by Activision to be a fucking... A, an agent of disinformation and misinformation by Activision, spreading out, you know, the good vibes on the Call of Duty games and getting paid probably handsomely. If not getting paid handsome, handsomely, cash direct, he's getting some kind of incentives from... Activision to be a, you know, Call of Duty drone that says the game's great and never says anything bad about it and just basically re-uploads, uh, you know, trailers and gets more views than the actual Call of Duty website itself. So that's fine. Whatever. That's not the point, but I just want to say that's the kind of person we're dealing with here. He'll, he'll accept cash for, you know, monetary gain regards to his own personal beliefs or personal interests. So he does a recruiting video for the Navy. And I think that's a super fucking scumbag, irresponsible move. And I don't really think it should be tolerated. I mean, not that it should be tolerated. It's like, this should not be tolerated. I'm going to take to the streets and fucking, you know, march on Wall Street. God damn it, down with the goddamn 1%. Oh, yeah. You know, okay. I mean, it'll be tolerated. But, I mean, I don't have to agree with it. And I think, like I said, it's fucked up. And the reason why I think it's fucked up and a dirty scumbag move like a car salesman with fucking AIDS is because your channel is a Call of Duty channel. Most of the people who watch your videos, uh, don't ask, like I said, how I watch them, a grown-ass 30-year-old man, which is kind of embarrassing that was on there. But I check that shit out from now and now to keep on fucking tabs as little scumbags just because, you know what, I got to keep my nose to the fucking ground, got to keep my ear to the railway tracks and hear the vibrations of the Call of Duty community just so I can stay relevant even though I don't even fucking upload Call of Duty in the last year or so because the fucking Call of Duty ghosts and Call of Duty in the last couple of years has Suck donkey dicks! Anyways, I'm really fucking missing the important point here in this commentary by talking like a Randy retard with a Tourette syndrome high on crystal meth. The point I'm trying to make is that his channel is a Call of Duty fucking channel. He does videos essentially for little kids and maybe like, you know, 15-year-olds or 16-year-olds at the most. I can't really see anyone above 16 or 17 really taking his shit seriously. You know, you go there for the information and you're not really going there for anything else. So... His channel is basically little kids, and it's irresponsible to go out there as a persona that people probably, you know, those age groups actually look up to, and I mean, I don't know, God for fucking bid, they respect, and they, you know, take his opinion. And I think his influence as a public figure in the Call of Duty and YouTube community is bullshit to be used as a Army, Navy recruiting video. Uh, essentially, kids are easily led, and now who knows? You know what? You're going out there... And it's just not a fucking conversation that a, a 18 year old fucking English twat with comb over hair basically rivaling Donald Trump pretty soon because he's bald as shit and he combs his hair from the back of his fucking back head uh, to cover up his bald spots. I'm fucking gone bald. You know what? Eddie the Chump's English. He's bald. That motherfucker shaves it off. He's sexy. He's got himself a girlfriend. I'm partly bald. Uh, you know, I fucking shit my shit down. Don't fight it, bro. Just shave the fucking head, LA, and join the goddamn aced head, master race, shaved head fucking nation. But you know what? You shouldn't use your. Um, 
I guess, your status in the YouTube community to take money from the fucking, I guess it was the English or I don't know what the fuck, it was the Navy at some point. It was English Navy or the Army. What does it matter? It's the Navy, whether it be United Kingdom or the American Navy. I'm pretty sure it's United Kingdom uh, Navy. If it's the American Navy, that's even fucking gayer because you're English. But nonetheless, and you're trying to influence little kids on the YouTube community to fucking join the Navy, putting the recruitment video in there, putting links and stuff to how to join the Navy and all that kind of shit. Which actually is kind of funny too because probably 9% of the subscribers aren't old enough to actually join the Navy because they are little kids. So what the fuck are you going to do? But the fact is, you know what? It's still goddamn influential on kids' minds because you're a fucking YouTube community kind of fucking Call of Duty god. Anyways, you guys be cool. That's all I want to say. Bullshit. Use your influence in the Call of Duty community to fucking purvey and perse and survey and fucking influence kids to join the Navy. Dog shit. Horrible move. LEA, you're a cocksucker. You're not a cocksucker. I mean, not literally. Figuratively speaking, you're probably a man who gets many ladies because you got lots of cash and you buy prostitutes. So anyways, y'all take care. Y'all be cool. Stay in school. Send no drugs. Look both across the street. This is all allegedly, by the way. So YouTube, anyone who belongs to his community, you can't take this video down. It's all allegedly. It's all jokes. It's not to be made taken seriously. So if you want to fucking try to take this video down by complaining or any of that kind of shit, you can't, motherfuckers, because it's all allegedly and I'm just making jokes. So it's for entertainment purposes only. So with that disclaimer said... Fucking be all you can be. Join the army. Take care, guys. Stay black and let the white men bring you down.